America, did you see my new drones that look like birds? Yeah, uh, new, new drones. Yeah, birds are, birds are definitely real. I knew it. I knew it. Y'all called me crazy when I said the birds are landing up there on the power lines to get a new charge. First it's the birds, and now y'all gonna find out next week that I was right, that house cats are alien spies. Okay, let's just forego the reason I did the shifty eyes to fuck with people. What, Florida? House cats are alien spies. How do you figure? Think about it. Cats are violent enough to survive out there in the wild by themselves, which is exactly what you would want your drone to be able to do. But they're also cute enough that we want to bring them inside, which is also something you would want your drone to do. You ever done anything and you just look over and the house cat is staring at you? You know, I hate to side with somebody who is known for notoriously doing weird shit, but that actually makes a lot of sense. In unrelated news, America, I heard that your current vice president, who's running for office, has now picked her running mate to run as her vice president. Yeah, and I just found out he's a retired sergeant major. Fourth wall break. Uh, these jokes may not make sense to a lot of civilians, but they're going to crush in the army community. <clears throat> I can't wait till he wins and talks to Congress about standards and discipline. Y'all ain't doggone going home until I get this doggone bill signed. Who? I can't wait to see for the first time in history we have a vice president have to caveat during the State of the Union address. So, uh, like the commander-in-chief was saying, who? Uh, we're gonna be doing a lot of things different, who? And the State of Our Union is great, who? Aren't y'all understand, who? All press briefings just got an extra 30 minutes added on top of them. I can't wait till he tries to order the vice chief of staff to take out their trash in the White House. Y'all doggone need to listen, Hua. We are the number one nation in the world, you understand me? And, uh, we will not have a dirty White House, Hua. Israel, my retaliation against you is going to be devastating. Oh my god, is it gonna be today? I have, like, a fraction of my find out just hanging out in the Mediterranean. Do you know, right now, they're having, like, Madden tournaments on board the Abraham Lincoln? Give them something to do! America, you think you're all big and mighty. I am not afraid of you. Iran. Forgive me for interjecting here, but you're in a very dangerous position. Of course you would side with your warmongers in the West. Listen to me. They just passed a, a bill or resolution or something that gives them the authority to use lethal force in the event of an attack. I, okay, let me put this in perspective. The United States is really good at fighting, and most of the time, as long as everybody in the world just chills the fuck out, they do it with each other. But God forbid that they all end up on the same side, and you are now the target of their aggression. First, I will destroy Israel, and then the West. Very well. Can't reason with stupid. America, do what you do best. You know what? I think it's time. Time for what? <sighs> this. There's no hiding it now. Kid. You know what? Fuck this game. I literally have one goddamn railroad. I'm getting taxed out the ass. And where the fuck did you get the 50s? You cheating little goddamn raccoon. What? Well, sorry to interrupt your monopoly, but you're up. Head to the Middle East. If Iran gets froggy, give him what for. Y you mean it? Now listen, kid. You keep your head about you. This is your first time in the game, all right? You be safe, you be careful. But, uh, if they want a piece, you give them the whole thing. Oh, yeah. This, this is a proud moment right here. All right, kid, listen up. You've trained, you've prepared, and you've been maintained. And now it's time to give them the business. So, if they want to meet their god, you go ahead and set up the meeting. <laughs> I won't let you down, Grandpa Buff. Well, uh... That was unexpected. Can we get a clean-up in Hangar 4? God, he's weird. You know, I love that kid, but he's gonna get so bored with those weak-ass Iranian aircraft, he's gonna start doing trick shots. <laughs>